big three were assembled. Some people questioning Spolster's command, maybe even within the team. Those questions are long gone now. He has become an excellent <laughs> Tim Duncan, when asked about his retirement plans right after the 2013 time, refused to dignify the question with the response. But last season, Spurs run answered loudly enough. The first one falls. And for Duncan and the Spurs, year after year, people write them off. And, Steve, they keep proving them wrong. It's incredible. I mean, I think I wrote them off four years ago, and here they are continuing to just be an elite team in the NBA. And Duncan, one of the big reasons for it. He seems to get better and better, and he loves the game. He continues to stay in great shape and compete. Who knows how long he'll go. Tim Duncan, in a lot of ways, the epitome of Steve Slepson's over stock. Yeah, no doubt, Kevin, in, both in terms of his game and his personality. He's just a winner and a leader. And he does it in such a quiet fashion that uh, sometimes people forget to take notice. Here's San Antonio. Nine points in a row. Good run for him right now. Sure. And when I think about Duncan's leadership, man, I could go on and on. I don't even know if I have enough time. But one of the things that stands out is he's never put himself above his teammates or the staff, but he allows himself to be coached extremely hard by Greg Popovich. He's relentless, dedicated. In many ways, he can lead without saying a word. And there's the foul. It's unjust. So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus. We'll go to the line to shoot two. We talk about Duncan a lot. Really, he's his own toughest player. As great as he is, he's hard on himself. He's pushed himself. And the first one drops. Nice find by the Spurs as a 3 and D role play. The Spurs always seem to find those kind of guys. The mid-second round pick was green. He got weighed by the Cavs, spent some time playing abroad. Now he holds the record for three-pointers made in the final. Here's what San Antonio is going with right now. Morris Diaz checked in for Spurs. Ginobili comes in for Leonard. And it's Mills in for Tony Parker. Both free throws get from Green. For Danny Green, guys, quality defender in either wing position. And, you know, Steve, as you would like to say, a floor spacer offensively. That's right. Two-way guys, you know, two-way players. That's what the playoffs are all about. You think about the success Green has had in the last couple of seasons. Defending star players in one end, knocking down big threes at the other. Wow, what a player he's been. And Miami calls their first time out of the game. 